Hello friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Michaela, and I make adult coloring videos here on this channel and today I am doing my first Christmas video of the season. I honestly was not expecting it to be this early in the season, um, it's literally October 11th when I'm filming this video, but the Belba family sent me very very kindly this all about Christmas coloring book and I knew I had to flip and review it for you guys. So that is what I'm here to do today. To be honest, I don't know if this is a new book to them this year because on the back it does say um, copyright 2020. So I'm thinking this book did come out last year, but it is perfect since it's been out for a while. So if you're looking for some sort of like Christmas gift to get early and you want it to be Christmas related, this is a good choice since it's already out. <clears throat> and I feel like it's a book you cannot be bored with because it's this book would take you forever to finish, I feel like. But let's just get into the flip through because there's a lot here. I did not color a page in this book yet because, <clears throat> excuse me, my throat constantly needs to be cleared. Um, I did not start a page in this book yet because I literally got it yesterday um, and I meant to, but I did not feel like it last night. Um, but this is all about Christmas and in this book we have um, color by number, 3 by 3 and 5 by 5 millimeter squares and more, so let's just get right into this flip through. This book is interesting. One thing I noticed first is that all the pages are actually numbered. That's not something I feel like you see normally. Um, and this book is just, uh, just on normal Amazon paper. Um, but basically this all about Christmas page basically explains what's in the book. Um, so you have a lot. I feel like you have the most of puzzle color by numbers. And then you have um, Mystery Mosaics, and then you have a few, um, I think like five color by number pictures. So we have a color palette page, and then we get into the table of contents. Um, so it tells you where certain things in the book are. Um, this is a little bit confusing. I'll explain in a second what I mean. Um, there are not nearly 60 pages of this, um, which I'll explain, but let's begin with the Puzzle Color by Number Clever Book Series for beginners. So this is Christmas Symbols and they're 5 by 5 millimeter sections. So this is a little bit difficult to show you guys um, for the sole reason that each page is literally going to look like this. So I'm probably not going to like flip flip through all these pages just a couple but basically it's really hard to see but over here we have um actually let me pick one maybe that goes down a little bit farther yeah so we have a bunch of um grid grid coordinates and we have this side which is a grid and you basically just fill in the colors um in each grid ordinate as in on here um, and I'm really excited to try this. I already know it's going to be incredibly incredibly tedious but I'm really excited to kind of see what that's like um, and see the picture really come to life because you know on those mystery mosaic books like you can kind I mean it really depends but you can kind of know what you're getting yourself into. With these I feel like you just have no idea what you're getting yourself into and I'm really excited to kind of see how that goes. I think it'll be really fun. Um, and I also noticed that in between each of these specific pages at the front part of the book have this page which is just like a blank and I wonder if that's so you can rip out either this, this side or this side. I want to say you're meant to rip out the, the like answer key I guess you can say it's not really an answer key but like the, the the grid coordinates I guess I think you're meant to rip them out and so that way you can kind of be more mobile about it and be able to um color it easier I'm not really sure but like I said we have these in between every one of those pages which is why this book feels really thick I was really surprised at first but then I realized kind of why the book was so thick but I'll flip through just a couple more for you guys, um, but then we'll move on to the next section. 
Some of them are vertical, some of them are horizontal. So yeah, that is that section of the book. Um, and this goes on until here, um, I believe. Yeah, it goes on till here. And then we begin the mystery mosaics. Christmas Feelings 3x3 three three millimeter sections, which are pretty freaking small. I'm not going to flip the book, um, but I'll just do a quick flip of these. Um, this is basically like, it's Mystery Mosaics. Um, you have a bunch of little squares, all your numbers. Um, if you guys have ever seen, I color in my Disney Mosaic Mystery Color by Number book, and very similar to this. So it'll create a beautiful picture. And I love this kind of style. I think it's gorgeous and you can do X method, you can do dot method, you can color it in all the way. That's typically what I do. Um, I've noticed in the Belba family books you can definitely kind of see what you're going to color, which is totally fine. Like, I'll actually flip this one to show you guys. Um, you can definitely tell that that's Santa with a bunch of trees and presents surrounding him um and i feel like you can only tell it because of how much white space there is but that would be a really fun one uh to start with but yeah we just have this and this one i think is a reindeer so yeah some of them you can tell i didn't my one disney book i have you can't really tell what the pictures are going to be just based off of looking um by the way completely off topic I didn't even really think about mentioning it in this video since it has nothing to do with it um but I just made another big Disney purchase it should be here soon so expect another big flip coming <laughs> I can't help myself um but anyways back to this beautiful book I am talking so much and not flipping enough we have Santa on here you can definitely tell some of these and I think it it's kind of makes it easier with the numbers you can it, it's weird the numbers you can literally see the pattern I don't know but then we move on to the last section which is the Christmas and travel mosaic color by number books and these are just your standard color by numbers um, I will flip the book for these since it would just make the most sense so these I've noticed are really detailed but they're super cute so also, this book would be great if you like their Christmas books, but you don't have any of them like me. Um, this is like the perfect book to get. And this book also is being sold hardcover. Um, I did get the soft cover version because um, something was happening in production and they couldn't quite get the hardcover out to me. Um, but I do believe they're still selling it as hardcover. But I'm totally cool. Oh no, I just <laughs> ripped the page from holding it. Oh goodness, but whatever. Um, yeah, it comes in hardcover. <laughs> you have that. Try not to rip the pages like I did. It's okay, it's still colorable. <laughs> Overall, I think this book has just a really fun vibe to it, and it perfectly brings in the season, I feel like. And you also don't have to color this book just during Christmas time. You could definitely color it year round, which I love. And then just to finish it off, um, they just let you know that um, you can leave a review for them and then they leave their Instagram and their Facebook. And then we just end the book with just some couple blank pages. And then the back of the book, which has some thumbnails of what will be in the book, which is fantastic. I love to see it. But that is it for this flip and I guess kind of review. It's a little hard to say review because I didn't really color in it yet. But I really wanted to give you guys a little bit of an in-depth look into this book since it is really fun. And again, Belba family, if you're watching this video, thank you so much for sending me this book to review. I really, really appreciate it. I love it a ton and I'm super excited to pull it out this holiday season. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below if you're not already. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye guys!